All right, you guys, we're going Tabula Rasa from Second Chance for this pairing. We're on, oh my God, we're on course number three. This is the finale. We're doing short ribs braised in this beautiful stuff, as well as a little bit of beef stock, garlic and onions. We're taking that, remember we took that liquid, we uh, strained it after cooking the, the short rib in it, so all that short rib goodness, all that grill, all that grill flavor that we created at the beginning got into that liquid. We've strained that, we've reduced that by a half to create that demi, add a little butter at the end, swirl it around, we're good to go. Let's get to plating. Oh my God, it's so good. Two gold, back to back gold medal winner GABF. Great American Beer Festival must mean it's good. So I'm taking some guess which herb, my favorite arugula, and I've already chopped some parsley. What we're doing is creating a gremolata right here. So just a really nice kind of fine diced salad uh, that usually goes on top of really rich dishes to help kind of cut through some of their unctuousness and fat. I've mixed that with chopped parsley right here. So we have arugula, we have parsley, we have those pickled onions once again. I've got those nice and chopped, real nice and fine. That's becoming part of the salad. I'm taking garlic. I've sliced that into little batons as well. But you don't have to be as neat as this. We just have to make sure we get that garlic nice and small because big chunks of garlic might be good for some of us. Like myself, my mom eats garlic cloves by the freaking bushel by the head, um, <laughs> and uh, but getting it nice and small so it just adds like a little background flavor is what we want. So just nice and fine like that is what we're looking for. We're mixing that all up together. We're adding a little bit of fine diced lemon once again, nice and fine and small because big chunks of lemon might be nice for some but not for all, but everybody can handle a little. So we're getting that nice and fine as well. This is, again is gonna be like our garnish to go on top of our, our uh, short rib that's gonna get that beautiful demi. That comes all together, boom. We got a nice little caramel, or excuse me, uh, pickled onion gremolata. Oh my God, it smells so good. The arugula, the lemons popping off. I'm getting hits of garlic, but a nice little, nice little salad, right? It's gonna go on top of the short rib. Let's go ahead and plate you guys. We have our mashed potatoes, herb butter floating along in there. Beautiful, down the middle. Boom, down the middle. Oh my goodness, you guys, look at this, watch. Oh, tender, delicious, decadent, rich. Melt in your mouth. Gorgeousness. We're gonna take our demi. Remember we finished that with a little bit of butter. It's thickened nice, so it's just gonna glide onto our short rib. We'll let that over, overflow a little bit. Give the potatoes something to play with. Oh, right there. And then gremolata. This is how easy it is, guys. Boom. A little something to the side. That's the dish. With our short rib course, you guys, beer dinner series at home, number two, short rib coming to you, birthday bacon, grilled veggie salad, three beers, I mean, it's not so bad at home, you know? Cheers, you guys, stay up.